New foundation time. We are going to try out some new foundation today. <clears throat> I have the number seven Stay Perfect Foundation for all skin types. It is a medium coverage, um, non-stop complexion perfection, all day wear, sunscreen, um, SPF 15. So we are going to try this. This is what we're gonna try. All right, so I do not have anything on my skin um, at all. We're going to go ahead and we're going to prime our skin like we normally do. Uh, I am going to use the uh, Yves Saint Laurent uh, that I usually use. How's everyone's quarantine gone? Good? Mine too. Yeah. Just putting on makeup. Prime, 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 prime time. I got some in my eyeball. Don't do that. That stinks. All right. So we are going to test the number seven Stay Perfect Foundation. It looks like this. I don't know if you can see that see it number seven it's a very beautiful packaging uh, it's a glass bottle um, it has a plastic cap I like the glass bottle it's very nice and it comes with a nice little pump uh, so we are going to there we go Ooh, it's not runny it's actually really nice Get my beauty blender ready. All right, we are gonna go in and test this foundation. I'm gonna see, you know, what it covers like, and then I'm also going to wear it for a few hours afterwards, and then check in with you guys um, later. the feel of it on our skin. It looks nice. Smells like really good um, like skincare, like a lotion. It smells like lotion. It's a nice color too. Oh, it feels really good. Like, it feels really moisturizing. I don't know if it's supposed to. But it feels really good. It's the middle of the night here. It is. In the middle of the night. I had a long day. I worked all day. This is not my job. This is fun. It's looking good so far. This may be my next go-to foundation. I actually really like it so far. Um, it's not creasing. It's not overly luminous. It feels really, really good on the skin. And this is in the shade, I'm so sorry you guys. Cool Vanilla, it's in the shade Cool Vanilla. I really, really like the feel of this foundation. It feels really, really good. It feels like a high end foundation and it's 
not that expensive. I think number seven is a, I think they're a British company or a European cosmetic company. Not exactly sure. Alright, that is all blended. What do you guys think? If you can see, it's kind of luminous. It's not caking at all. It's not exaggerating my pores. Alright. Let's see how this foundation plays with concealer, concealer that I use all the time, like the ColourPop. Um, so let's put some of that on and see how they play together. Because, you know, sometimes the foundation and the concealer and the powder, you know, different brands, different formulas may not jive. <laughs> I said jive like I'm 80. Here, here, here. I think that that's why, even though this concealer cakes a little bit, um, that I've noticed, that's why I continue to use it, at least for right now, because it does really brighten underneath my eyes. does brighten and I really like that. So, so far they seem to be playing okay. Bright, bright. Oh my god, do you guys remember light brights? For you, I don't know if any of you were like that old, but when I was a kid I used to have a light bright and I played with it all the time. It was like my favorite toy. All right, now we'll go in with our true and trusted Laura Mercier setting powder. I'm really tired, you guys. Can you notice? All right. Now, I am going to go and I'm gonna put on the rest of my makeup. Um, I'm gonna do an eye look, some bronzer, you know, yada yada. And then we'll come back and we'll talk about how this foundation is wearing. Hi guys, so I have been wearing this foundation for um, a while, for a couple of hours now, and I do just want to let you know it looks really nice. Um, I don't see any caking. I don't see, you know, it's still really luminous. I still really like it. Uh, it's doing really, really well. If you can tell, I have I shot another video, uh, as you can tell by my face, so you'll see that one soon. But um, really good foundation. Again, I really like this foundation. It's the number seven Stay Perfect uh, foundation. It looks like this. It comes in a bottle like this. I really, really like it. I think this is going to be my new go-to foundation. So if you're looking for an inexpensive, I think it's like $17, $18, go pick it up. It's a really, really good foundation. It wears really nicely and I approve. So if you can, um, again, if you like my videos, hit that subscribe button, um, hit the bell so that you know when I come out with new videos. 